Hi everyone, my name is Arvin Olano. Welcome to my YouTube channel. You know, nobody asked. Well, maybe a few of you did. You seem to really miss my shop with me video. So today we are going to Ikea and I'm gonna be as realistic and as nice as I can be. <laughs> Spoiler alert, I don't like Ikea, so let's go. There she is. Miss Ikea. Guys, we are not off to a great start. What is this? I want, I don't like that at all. <laughs> I figured we could go around the showroom. Maybe we can find some cool vignettes. I honestly have no idea how to navigate this place, so wish me luck. I'm into this moment. What is this? Oh, wow. Besta? Oh, she's the Besta? <laughs> Okay, I actually really like this. I like this detail. I am so shocked. It's so modern. Very chic. It's $600. I'm not mad at the color, too. Is this a push to... Oh, it is a push to open. And then what's around here? I even like this situation up here, too. Kind of giving you an idea to do your own gallery wall. If you have a cabinet like this, and I'm also feeling those modern lights, sconces. You know, I'm not mad at the sofa. This is Finala, 1299. I'm into this like red and cream kind of pattern. It's kind of giving traditional, but I love that they didn't do it with like traditional textiles you know what i mean if it was like they did like a furry kind of boho textile um i would probably just do like plain pillows i'm even into this chair oh my gosh are you kidding me 119.99 wait let's do a little test oh that's comfortable are we allowed to test the furniture yes okay <laughs> i'm not sure oh let me try it Oh, that's actually, that's nice. Okay, hold on, let me try this chair. Oh, you know, there's a lot of like vintage Ikea rattan pieces like on eBay and Etsy that sell for like hundreds and hundreds of dollars. This one is 120, so she's a good deal. What do you think of this red, babe? A little too orangey. You think so? It has a nice, like, linen texture, and it's only $8.99. Okay, I might have been hating on Ikea for, like, no reason. <laughs> Listen, I'm shocked. I thought I was gonna hate a lot of the things in here. I was wrong. Let's, let's go look. Okay, we made it to the coffee table, side table area. And again, I'm kind of loving what I'm seeing. So let's um, let's take a look. Absolutely not. What are these? Okay, Andrew says he likes this. Oh, she's new. Oh, the Lister Bee. It's an oak veneer. Okay, so just keeping it real. You can see like this little seam line where they place the oak veneer on top of the table. But if you look at her, it's giving like Scandinavian. I feel like you could even do it in a traditional space. And 179 is great, you guys. Oh, look at that, babe. I'm into that too. Oh, she's heavy. I mean, again, oak veneer, but $99. I love that. And Oh, here's a better look at that coffee table. It even comes in a rectangular one. 55 inch, oh, that's good. The side tables are great too, 
I love this like darker walnut. Actually, it's like a dark brown oak over the white oak. I feel like it's a little more fresh. Andrew distracted me when I was looking at these. Oh, I hate these. <laughs> Storage table? No, I would never. I guess that's what it looks like up there. I just feel like that looks so cluttered. You see that? I just like, I can't. Okay, anyway. Oh, I saw this table the last time I was in Ikea, like eight months ago. <laughs> it's 299 Stockholm coffee table. It's giving mid-century. It's giving like vintage vibes. You already know how I feel about a rattan woven situation, so. Love her. You can find something similar from like really expensive Danish, Scandinavian stores and they sell it for a lot of money. Okay, should we go to the sofa section? Okay, let's take a look. What the hell is this? And this, what? No, absolutely not. But back to this. She is a messy queen. <laughs> Who is she? Back Salon? Honey, she needs to go back to the warehouse. Not looking like that. No, that's too messy for me. Even if you like a relaxed, casual vibe, that's just not the vibe. Like this, I feel like I would like fall through the cracks and I feel like the sofa would break. Okay, back to this coffee table situation. I don't, und what? What is happening? <laughs> no. Okay, no. Okay, let's move on. The sofa section is kind of scary. Not gonna lie. Some of them just look a little... Mm. But I do, I do see something over here. I'm into this green moment. You guys know I love a green. Who is she? Paroop. <gasps> Vissel dark green. Oh, that's delicious. Yes. Absolutely not. Yes? Do we like this? Who is she? Vin Lidden. Oh, okay, kind of soft. Hmm. I don't know. Not a fan of the sofa section. I just probably would not buy a sofa from here, it scares me. This basic bitch pendant. <laughs> Miss Sinnerlig, she is everywhere, hunty. Don't get her, I don't like her at all. Whoa, you know what? For whatever reason, I am not mad at her. Even the print, there's this interior designer that I follow, and in one of her designs, she has like a very floral red chair in this like really modern living room with a marble mantle. There's just something about mixing a very kind of chintzy traditional print like this and putting it in a modern space that feels fresh, feels very now. Um, but I wouldn't do it like print on print on print. You know what I mean? Like do like white drapes, do a simple sofa, or not simple sofa, a simple rug, and then a statement printed upholstered sofa. Okay. I'm into it. By the way, here's what I'm wearing today. This knit cardigan is from H&M. The best shorts ever. These are from Aritzia. This bag is actually an Amazon find and I love using it for kind of like low key casual days. Comes in a ton of other colors as well. And just some white sandals to keep it fresh for summer. I will link these down below for you if you're interested. Not this, I absolutely, oh. No, 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 no. I hate the teal with the dark gray. This design just feels so dated. You know what I mean? Like sound off in the comments if you agree. This like dark gray with the teal and I would be afraid that that will collapse and hit my head. So no. Ooh, in this next area, we have a little coastal moment. You know, I do like a coastal design, but kind of went overboard with the blue and white art. Ooh, is that concrete? She's pretty. Oh, it's Abesta again. Oh. Actually, I'm not mad at that. It's kind of cool and fresh. 
very modern. I could see that in like a wabi-sabi space, mid-century. You know what? I feel like a lot of interior designers talk about IKEA cabinets, and I don't know if this is exactly what this is, but I know you can like do different custom options and you can replace the fronts. Oh, yeah, maybe that is it. Not real wood, I don't think that's real wood, but I'm kind of into it. Oh, but I hate that. <laughs> oh, God, no. I do want to show you something over here. Come over here. I was hating on these chairs in my last IKEA video, but I kind of love them now. I think they're called the Win... Win back. <laughs> actually, I don't know what they're called. They are called the Strand Mom. This is actually kind of a vibe. I mean, the houndstooth is really cool, and if you're gonna do a houndstooth chair, please don't do houndstooth curtains. Like, it's just overkill, you know what I mean? I would just do plain white, creamy white drapes and let the chair speak for itself. Like, this is what I hate. Like, I hate when things just match. If you wanna trap dirt and dust and grime and pet hair, then get this rug. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I like the ottomans though. That's cute. Like a herringbone almost. Chic. I hate this lacquered besta though. It's not cute. It's like giving plastic dollhouse. Okay, we made it to the chair section. I love a good chair. I have a chair obsession. I like collecting them. We found Strand Mom, Stranded Mom, <laughs> in plain velvet and corduroy are you <gasps> you guys i'm kind of into the corduroy one i'm kind of imagining this like reupholstered in like a fuzzy like sherpa material it would be so chic so high-end so designer i just can't okay sorry i hated you last year but i love you now um okay what's next the rocker is kind of cool and there's a few other rattan chairs there. I'm not seeing any that I'm liking though. Oh, hello. Ekanasset. Hi. I'm into you. You seem really good quality. And this fabric too is great. Great fabric. Do we like her? This kind of reminds me of the iconic clam chair, the way the back is. That's beautiful. Oh, I found more cubes. Okay. Her name is Kedjabo. She's cute, $99. Do we like her better than the Target Ottomans? I'm into the herringbone one, actually. You know what? I feel like when they do a plain velvet like this chair, it looks very chic. This is the Flinschult. Wow. Hi, Strand Mom. I'm obsessed with her. Like, really obsessed with her. We made it to the cabinet section, and here's a goodie. It's the Billy Bookcase. Everybody loves her. I actually prefer this with almost the wood grain. Looks a little more high end, right? I'm trying to see if there's any new styles that I haven't seen before necessarily. Let's go over here. Oh, I like this. Okay. Very Scandi. Or snas. Pretty simple, actually. Here's a great traditional option, the Lia Torp. Oh, but the Lomarp in this, like, green color is quite handsome. But I love the brass. Very chic. Obviously not my style, but I know a lot of you will like her. Hi, green kitchen moment. Okay, kind of nice. The only thing I would change is probably not do like a polished gold. I think it's making it look very cheap. Compared to that last cabinet that we saw, looked so much more expensive because the brass was matte. Look at the green kitchen. I'm honestly into her. Okay, wait, hold on. Okay, do we see the matte? So much more beautiful than the polished. But that's just me. That's like, you know, that's my taste. I don't want it to be so shiny. Very, very into it. How charming is that? Miss Bjorksnaz also has a kind of sort of matching bed. 
I don't know. That looks a little flimsy to me, but I'm into her. I think I've had enough of the showroom. Let's go downstairs to the marketplace. Maybe we'll find some cute things down there as well. We made it to the marketplace. Let's see if we can find anything nice and cute. Okay. Not nice. <laughs> oh, not the fake olive tree. What else is here? Oh, this place is boring. This is all like containers and organization. And my life is not this organized, so we're gonna move on. I don't know why, but I'm kind of into that little bird floral situation. Would be so chic. Even these too, this little wall hanging, it almost looks vintage, doesn't it? Oh yeah, I'm into her. Angaboda. Hello, Angaboda. Um, I'll probably just do like a, what is it? Rub and buff? Buff and rub? To make it a little more bronzy? Very chic, but let's, let's talk about her. Is it me? Am I liking grand, the grand millennial traditional trend? I think if you pair it with a very chic, minimal bed, like very modern bed, and have that on top, would be really cool. This is a great little idea to make your guests feel super special. For $2.99, you can put a pair of slippers in their room. Or if you are an Asian house and you don't like having shoes inside the house, have these handy for your guests, am I right? Let's take a look in the pillow section because sometimes they do have very pretty textiles that are good quality. Loving this color, Miss Die Tag. D Tag? Okay. Not into it, not into it. These darker colors, no. Oh, what is that? Ooh, okay, here we go. Okay, green. Hey, girly. <laughs> hey, girl. Um, oh, green boucle. Like a little Sherpa. I like that. 20 by 20 for $7.99. It's a great little find. You guys know this is like my color palette here. Miss Earthy Colors. Mm, I think this is the one we saw earlier that I really like. Should I get one of those? I'm kind of into it. It's 20 by 20. Okay, let's grab a few actually. Very chic. Vanderpump? <laughs> Great little piece. It's flat woven, so maybe good for like, I don't know, a kitchen maybe or a hallway? I'm into that. Like I'm really, really into her. I need to give it up to Ikea because these vintage rugs are delicious. Are you kidding me? Look at the brown stripe. The brown stripe. It's so good. <gasps> Even this. This like purple. Wow. Ikea. But make it fashion. Is that a vibe? No, huh? <laughs> Let's take a quick look here in the lighting section. No. No. Yes! Absolutely yes. $59.99. Okay. I mean, okay. Yes, we can have an Astrid moment. Yes. No. Yes. <gasps> Taliban. Yes. That is a very chic lamp. No. Not the Paris street art. Anything but that. I guess I'm really into like red and oxblood colors right now because yes. All right, everyone, that was it for me today. Thank you so much for watching. I'm still shocked that I liked so many things at Ikea today, but that's kind of what I love doing. I can go to any store, find the best pieces and recommend it to you guys. Anyway, hit that subscribe button before you go and don't go yet to watch this video next and I will see you in that video. Bye everyone.